morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be at. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be at. Narcissists. Uh, narcissists aren't just female characteristics. Narcissists aren't just male characteristics. Narcissists uh, can be a behavior exhibited by both men and women. Uh, a narcissist, uh, by Google, uh, by the definition uh, from the World Wide Web, whatever website uh, you look at, uh, is individuals who have a high sense of their own importance, a high sense of me's, a high sense of I's. It isn't a high sense of we or us, it's a high sense of I, it's a high sense of me. Uh, and they feel as though um, they are more important uh, than you. They feel that they're on this high horse of king or queen. They feel as though no one is, 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 is of more value than themselves. On that note, um, realize uh, what you are bringing into a relationship. Uh, and I'm going to say this as respectfully and humbly as possible. Realize what you are bringing into a relationship. All right? Don't forget what you are bringing into a relationship. Because you can't be a narcissist and go on without not being able to feed yourself, not being able to close yourself, struggling to pay bills, don't have a car. Uh, 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 uh. Basically, a narcissist, uh, to me, is someone who you'd have a difficult time replacing. Right, If you have a high sense of your own importance, uh, if you feel that you are better than others, that means that, to me, you're bringing a lot to the table from a man or a female perspective. But a lot of these narcissists are <laughs> the exact opposite. Or the exact opposite. In my own personal opinion, a narcissist is someone who can't be replaced because of their value not just their self-value, but their value to me and their value to others. But unfortunately, that is not the case. If you are going to be a narcissist, be someone who cannot be easily replaced. Be someone who's one in a million. Be someone who's more than, than looks, more than style. Be someone who's more than a picture, a photo, an album. We can't let narcissists value themselves and devalue us. We can't let narcissists put us down, break us down, break our heart. We can't let narcissists hurt us anymore. The times for letting people verbally abuse us, tear us down, those days are gone. Narcissists like to play the blame game. Narcissists like to say, hey, this is your fault. Narcissists love to say what you did wrong. That is one of the key characteristics of a narcissist. Saying what you did wrong. Pointing the finger. You know what else is a key characteristic of a narcissist? Not apologizing. Not saying they're sorry. Not saying what they did wrong. Not seeking help. Not going to counseling. These are key characteristics of narcissists. You know why they don't want to apologize? It's because they never think they did anything wrong. You know why they're always saying what you did wrong? Because they never feel like they did anything wrong. These are key characteristics of narcissists. And we're surrounded by them. Some of us are in our lives. Some of us are our friends. Some of us are our family. Some of us are, in our, are, are our partners in these relationships. If you can't say you're sorry, that means you don't feel like you did anything wrong. But guess what, ladies and gentlemen? It takes two people to argue. It takes two people to fuss. It takes two people to fight. It takes two people to get into a disagreement. It takes two people to do these things. If I'm saying something to you and you're not saying nothing back, did we have an argument? Did we have a fight? Did we have an agreement? If I say something to you that is nasty and you say something to me that is nasty, 
we both did something wrong. But unfortunately, these narcissists don't feel like they did anything wrong. These narcissists don't feel like they're in a position to apologize because <laughs> you hurt their feelings. And you're wrong for hurting their feelings. Uh, just be careful. Listen, it's not the end of the world. It is worse conditions, worse, me worse mental health conditions to have. Uh, but for these people that are narcissists, don't let them interrupt your life. Find peace. Uh, but most importantly, uh, attempt to forgive them and get them help. Um, there is counseling services out there, online, free, cheap, uh, that will get them the help they need. It's not the end of the world. Uh, try to forgive them. Uh, but most importantly, what you have to have with dealing with the narcissist is <laughs>